Shadow friend. Yeah, I want to play Shadow Fiend sometime soon. I forget. I forget every game. I'm just gonna take TA against me like that? You just gonna pick TA? Seems kind of rude. Let's do mid darks here. The curveball. Bat him. I could have. I could have picked something gross like Huskar or Batrider or some hard counter, but this is a. Uh... <clears throat> this is a fun way to approach the game. I'm gonna do something different. Actually, why do you always stalk me when I go into my room? You're like, get up, follow me, follow me in here, and then fucking stare at me. What's the deal, dog? God damn, my SF is popping off. <laughs> Decent start. Get it ultra, go, go, boy. <laughs> uh, close. <laughs> he almost got an ultra kill. Start the game. That is quite the start. That's the... The buff effect, even though it does literally nothing right now. Not bad. Hello? Oh, he's DC'd. He's back. I don't want to kill someone when they're AFK. No honor. It is a bad kill. Kill when AFK. 10 year shame. 10 year shame, ball stop working, bad harvest. That's what happens. Imagine relying on refraction. Does that spell? What does it even do? Nothing. Not to us. Toxic has pretty decent starting armor. He does, yeah. It's not too bad. Definitely good enough. Uh, CM is probably the last hero we want to see show up like that. Oh, we didn't even take the first rune here. So Radiant is a possible build. I'd say possible. I'm not sure if it's best. Maybe. Maybe it is, actually. It's a Darkseer versus TA and PO. It's definitely not bad. But uh, I think we don't have to go for it first item. We can go Aghanims and be active and be strong. So we don't have a drawback. Buyback? Uh, does playing TA so much help me playing against it? 
Um, somewhat. <laughs> it should, but I have this tendency to just line up for the side blade, even when I'm playing against the TA, not when I'm playing TA. <laughs> you know, like yeah, that could be a cool side blade, and it's like, oops, <laughs> whoopsie. I am not the TA. But, uh, you know, in theory, it's really good. No! <laughs> oh my god, they brought the everybody. Okay, well, meanwhile, my Midas Ogre is taking a tower, my SF is free, I think it's okay. I think it's okay, you know. Maybe I do go for the Rushed uh, Radiance. I was considering the Aghanim Scepter first, because it's so active and strong. Oh my god, they bring so many people every time. Oops. Well, he had help again. He always got the fucking backup, dude. I can surge you and you can run at him. Or you just land a hook. Jeez. Radiance has the added benefit of giving us evasion and mischance here, which is pretty amazing against TA plus PL. Why are there always more heroes? Also, the mischance ruined his Janata hit there, As you which is kind of funny. Do I just go Lotus Orb next? I want Aghanims though. But this is a very good Lotus game. Kind of just solves everything they can do. When you say it like that, it sounds like a pretty good item. <laughs> the enemy attacks your bottom it's hard to not want it when it just takes away all their abilities of doing things. Yeah, it will make Bounty cry, it will make CM cry, it will make the TA cry because it's a big armor item. It's a, it's a very valid item here. Yeah, it's really legit. Vampire. Not a vampire. But we can be Gossamer, which is pretty cool. Gossamer against the TA. It's not bad. Yeah, the shard on Darkseer is also crazy good. It's a really annoying shard to play against. Well, I do think of it a good shard. I don't necessarily think we have to buy it next. But we could buy it um, after the Lotus, I think. Oh, my SF got... Oh, I got debated. Ha! He debated me. And there's a bounty up here. Do not keep chasing.
Uh, anyone? Any reactions? Global silence is nice. Ow! The fuck? Let's wait a bit so we can surge in on this in case he has a trap. Gives him less time to react. Don't be so scared. He's weak. Fucking 3000 HP Ogre is like, oh, dare I possibly perchance step close to thee? My boy needs more, more Zog Zog in this gameplay. Less being worried and more being a smork. It's gonna be hard for him to fight into uh, fight into me when I have Aghanim Scepter. I mean, Shard is solid here as well. I think maybe I should buy it, but ah, uh, that Aghanims could not come soon enough. Thank you for the gold. <laughs> Keep throwing that Aghanim's lands, boy. You're just paying me. Wow, what a gamer. Yeah, they had a ward. That's how they managed to make that move. Oh well, I have my axe now. The fuck? See him as a BKB? Okay, that's... That's a little bit of a surprise. Yeah, rush BKB on CM is very good. Uh, we're gonna go to Fine Chill. This can fuck people up. Aghanim's supposed to Fine Chill uh, Darks here. This is a combo. That if you have not been initiated to it, you will be a little bit surprised when it happens to you. He tried to juke again. Not this time. Not this time, motherfucker. <laughs> yoink! Yoink, yoink. Pull him to the left or punch him to the right. The fucking setup. Yeah, that's that's indeed where I TP. <laughs> right, you are TA. Okay, the new try actually briefed me. It uh, wasted my uh, normal punch on something else. It didn't hit TA. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I just throw an SF on him. That looks normal. Happening down here. Neum. The fuck? You shot me? Come here. Come here, little hoodwink. What's that? Boom. Boom! Normal punch! Consecutive normal punches! You can't stand against it. Where's the attack speed coming from? Right now? Bloodlust. Can I not have it be griefed by a fucking peel illusion? Oh my god, I actually... Thought this neutral item would be so nice, but the peel has actually triggered it so much, making it bad. The peel randomly throwing a lance at me and uh, griefing it is actually a counterplay to the uh, Defiant Chill. It's ruining my agonims all over. Oh, there are five minutes left. Seeing a PL get utterly destroyed is such a beautiful sight. <laughs> it's something fun about seeing a PL try and survive when he's just nowhere close strong enough. He's like, Double Walk, uh, Mantasta, uh, uh. <laughs> and then he dies anyway.